Mom, I know there are times that I drove you nuts with all the stupid stuff that I did. If it makes you feel any better, you only know the half of it. Welcome to my world. We just celebrated Mother's Day and Captain Ruby Kay's birthday and it's like once a year that we have a party at our house and it's always so much fun. We've been blessed to have amazing weather every year and it just got me thinking like Ruby's the reason I am a mom. She made me a mother. Well, a little help from Mark, but um how much it's changed my life because I, I really I never thought that I would be a mother I didn't really have that desire and some of my friends know you know know what I'm talking about or some of you women can relate to that and I'm totally grateful for it it's been fun I've learned a lot about myself um, patience is the first one that comes to mind and that I'm gaining patience <laughs> I've realized that I don't have much patience um, but it's hard. Parenting is hard. Um, there's also a lot of rewards to it, but it, it, I mean, it changed so much. Um, my lifestyle, my choices, my habits. Um, it's been a trip, man. I'm starting to see, I'm starting to see glimpses of hope. It's funny. She, um, that Ruby girl, she was 10 and a half pounds and 22 inches long when she was born. She's a big old baby. I was pregnant at what seemed like forever. And... She, I, I nursed her for freaking ever, three years. She was, um, I loved when she was a baby, even like 18 months old. And then the toddler stages was really hard for me. And like messes, I hate messes because I don't like to clean. So I don't make messes so I don't have to clean. Well, with a kid, that is, oh God, it makes me crazy. It makes me absolutely crazy. So. Um, and then three was hard, four was hard, five, five and a half, I started seeing glimpses of hope, so now she's six, and I hope that we just keep progressing and learning together and <laughs> working as a coherent team, um, and it just makes me think and appreciate my mother and my grandmothers and even, you know, I had a really good relationship even with my great-grandmother. And, man, you know, I've got it, I don't want to say so easy compared to the generations of mothers in my family, but we have so many resources and tools, and if Ruby's going through something, I can Google it to find tips to help me be a better parent, or, I don't know, we, I just feel like there's so many resources nowadays versus when my great-grandmother, I mean, she had like five or six kids. My grandma had five kids, my mom had three kids, and I have one, and how am I so stressed out just having one child? But, I shouldn't say I'm so stressed out, but it's, damn it, man, it's hard. It is hard. So to all you mothers, soon to be mothers, someday will be mothers, to the mothers that have passed, to the um, working moms, to all you females, <sighs> mad props, man. Best okay, thing about having a mom, and I can't wait to be a mom, is her being my best friend. What I love about my mom is that she is one of my very best friends, and I love stealing her clothes out of her closet. Uh, luckily, we wear the same size, and she has good taste. So. <laughs> Two little boys, and they are my everything. They are so active. I love it. I love doing things with them. So why do I like being a mom? A mom is very, very challenging. It has tons of ups and lots of downs, too. But the most rewarding part is spending time with your kids, watching them grow, watch them do those first things for the first time, watching their smiles on their face, and knowing that I need them just as much as they need me. Happy Mother's Day! 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 Happy Mother's Day!